Welcome to week number four for Terry. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is a free six week course where our slimmers are trying to lose a stone in the six weeks. Hi Terry. Hello. You've got some good news for us haven't you? Yeah I lost another 2.5 pounds. Yay! <laughs> so this is a total of eight and a half pounds and we're only halfway through the course yeah isn't that fantastic so i'm pleased to say that this week you've got your half stone certificate even though you're just over halfway aren't you so that's fantastic what have you done this week differently than what you've been doing before because you've lost more um didn't go wing <laughs> <laughs> so you've basically eaten out less then is the secret yeah eaten out less um I'd say I had like a little mini blip, I think it was, was it yesterday? Yesterday. I just didn't eat well yesterday. I, I kind of, it, but it wasn't, it wasn't bad, but then I realised it was bad when I put it on the thing and I was like, oh God. <laughs> right, let's have a little look in your food diary then to see what's been happening. Right, yeah. so this morning you've had Weetabix. Uh, yeah. For lunch, uh, chicken chow mein. Yeah. And then for dinner, a uh, haddock with cinnamon wheel chips and sweet corn. Yeah. Are you having anything else today? No. Okay. So great. Well done. Uh, yesterday. So biscuits for breakfast. It was literally biscuits the whole day. So that salad at the bottom was what I had early hours in the morning at work. <laughs> what? Um... <laughs> How did you manage to eat all these biscuits? What what happened? I literally like had um had some biscuits before I went to sleep, and then I got up like about four in the afternoon and just had some biscuits and didn't want anything <laughs> more. Okay. And I, in and I thought, oh my god, it's how many calories? <laughs> <clears throat> so these are basically they're the ASDA version of um chocolate hobnobs yeah chocolate hobnobs per 16 <laughs> biscuits which is half the container is that right yeah or nearly all the container 0 0.7 1000 calories and 42 <laughs> yeah what's up Millie? don't be embarrassed because the good thing is i love your honesty like you said you've tracked them so you don't need to feel bad about it did yeah. you enjoy them? Yeah, it was really nice to be fair. <laughs> I think I just needed a bit of a bit of a boost because I'd been at work for the past uh, couple of nights and I thought, oh, I feel a bit of biscuits. So <laughs> I was a bit silly, but I'll be yeah. honest with you, they're my favourite as well, Terry. So not only have I put it in my diary that I need to come round your house on uh St David's Day next year, I also need to come out around whenever you've got the chocolate hobnobs out as well. <laughs> You're going to be my new perfect eating partner, I tell you. I know, yeah. But the good news is, yeah, later in the evening, you did have a salad at work, didn't you? Um, That was, I, I put that as a snack because I don't know where to put it because I have it early hours of the morning. Yeah. So I had it before I got back. So looking at your food diary as a whole, it's really not bad because you've had your meat in there, you've had your beef, uh, you've had your salad as well. So... Again, this is why I'm not alarmed at those biscuits because it is life is all about balance. So that's fine. <laughs> yeah, that was the only blip I had, I'd say, in the week. Um, yeah. I've not had much veggies, so I've tried to deal with what I've had um, until I did some shopping today. Um, so I've, I've just tried to balance it out, and obviously I've had my salads at work. So I think I've done well. My only shortfall was um, trying to keep up on water but I had this beauty come the other day, so I've started using this today. Oh, great. The TikTok bottle is here. Great. So I've had today 2,050 millilitres of water today, and that's the most I've had in, in weeks. So that's two and a half litres of water, which is fab. Yeah. Right, going back to your food diary, Saturday you had Weetabix for breakfast, uh, for lunch, um, some of those sour cream and chive thins 
with spreadable cheese and a bit of pickle. Um, and then the evening you had chicken tikka and cauliflower rice. How was that? That was actually quite nice. It was a bit spicy. I got yeah. it from, I think it was, it was Lidl. And it was a bit spicy, but it was quite nice. Yeah, I can see it's called What's Cooking. Was it in the fridge section or the freezer section? The freezer. Oh, was it? Because yeah, I, I haven't it. seen any ready meals that have got cauliflower rice. So I'm definitely up for trying that. Yeah, it's, it's in the Lidl. And um, it also does that chow mein that I had um, today. So it does that. And then there's like hot pots and stuff as well. Right. And the uh, meat and pasta. Right, if we can just pause this while I popped a little, that'll be great. <laughs> <laughs> right, no, we'll finish your diary. Uh, Friday, <laughs> uh, Friday, you must, you were obviously at work, were you? Were you sleeping a lot? Yeah. Uh, no, I was sleeping a lot on Friday. Yeah, because that's the end of your shifts, isn't it? So your jacket potatoes with cheese, with, sorry, beans in the evening. Yeah. Uh, Thursday is a uh, bit of ice cream, Knickerbocker Glory. Where was that at? Oh, um, you know, after school, the blooming yeah. ice cream van was there, wasn't it? Oh, and you had a Knickerbocker. <laughs> but... It was outside and it was, the kids got one. And then I thought, oh, you know what, I, you know, I'll get one because I used to always get one. And I thought, I'll, I'll treat myself because I've done well. Yeah. And, uh, I got one, but then by the time I got home, I gave it to my daughter. So I only had like the top part of it. Oh, okay. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> and those Knickerbocker Glories, I think, are they the ones that come out of the freezer or is it one is made with Mr. Whippy? No, it comes out of the freezer. So it, I did scan it and it went on. It, it was actually on this. Yeah. So that's good. Because, yeah, because when people think Knickerbocker Glory, they think one of their masses things you get in a restaurant. It's not quite yeah, like that, we, is we it? We to make them. So oh, we this... used to them as kids, honestly. They were heaven. <laughs> I'll be coming around to your mums as well. Right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> right. For dinner, chicken tikka masala with rice and salad. In the snacks, which is obviously when you were in work, uh, there was salad with ham and beef yeah wednesday um chicken strips with mini tortilla wraps and peppers and salad so you had a wrap at home yeah we all had a wrap day <laughs> more salad more salad in the evening you also had some pork pork crunch also known as pork crackling was that a yeah, snack at work good. Um, no, they were at home and my partner had bought me, I think it was like two days before that. And I was there like, oh, I'm going to try and stay away from them because I know they're quite high. And then I like grabbed down the like crisp bit from my kids and then I saw them and I thought, you know what, <laughs> I'll get them out of the way. They are high in calories, but they are they have got some good fats in there. So they will keep you feeling full. So they're certainly better than crisps. I'll, I'll give you that. OK. Oh, yay. <laughs> so well done to your lovely partner for buying you though. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then the last day is Tuesday where you had the sweet clam for breakfast. Um, and then you have the sl swimming world, slimming world diet Coke chicken with the rice. Uh, and then again, there's another salad there that you must have had it in the night shift. So amazing. I think you've done so well, Terry. Thank you. That's really, really good. How have your steps been this week? Um, I don't think I've done that great on them because I forgot where I've put my watch. Yeah. Um, and my phone doesn't seem to be tracking properly. Okay. It's still not, still not doing it. So I need to um, obviously get out more and know. And I'm trying to do, watch your videos. You know, when you're doing the 5K, I'm trying to watch them again. So I can, so I know I'm definitely got done half and most likely complete 10,000 a day hopefully right I'm doing another one in the morning another live video in the morning so feel free to join in live or catch up however okay yeah and the last thing I wanted to talk you talk to you about before we go is Chelsea yes have you seen the news this week she has got yeah. her four stone certificate what do you think 
I'm really, really proud of her. I've commented on it and said that she's like my inspiration to keep going. Oh, so she's doing amazing, absolutely fantastic. You see, I posted that in the middle of doing my online coaching tonight, so I haven't, I haven't watched the comments come in. So when I went back and saw all the amazing comments she's got, I had to call her straight away because I was like, oh my god, people are loving you so much. Yeah, honestly, she's done absolutely fantastic. And, and, like you, as well. and like you told me at the start of the course, you know, a lot of people are seeing her out on the street walking, aren't they? And I think this is why she's got so much support, because people are almost like she's losing weight right in front of their eyes, isn't she? Yeah, definitely. Amazing. And she's doing it so well as well. It's not like she's on some shakes and stuff like that and doing it all that. She's doing it the proper, healthy, good way. Absolutely, yeah. Which is, again, great for her daughter as well, with who's carrying on and joining in with her. Definitely. Great. Right, thank you so much. Well done. Um, did I ask you how many pounds you want to lose by next week? No. What would you... What are you going to say? Um, I want to lose at least three... Just so then at three or four, so I'm out of that stone range. Okay, great. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, because uh, I haven't been in that, that range for at least, I'd say, a year. And that's normally where I hit a brick wall. So I'm hoping I can get past it and I'll be really happy. Right, we're going to smash you through that brick wall, I tell you. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> great. Well done. Thank you so much, Terry. I will speak to you next week. I'll speak to you next week. All right. Bye for now. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.